Hello everyone, are you ready for another fucking adventure? It's me, Wogi here. Here for another good old grind to talk with Dokkan. What the hell? Already in progress, by the way. Uh, I need to grind. That's it. It's grinding talk time. I'm not grinding them for any specific reason other than I kind of want them. And that's really the only reason I want them. Because, um, what's the word? I think you need these guys for extreme Z area, but that trunks looks booty butt cheeks so I ain't gonna be doing some shit event just for a shit character so I'm really just grinding these characters because I want them so oh boy let me tell you man it's been a crazy fucking couple of days let me tell you having having to deal with evac stuff for the fire has completely thrown off my rhythm as far as uh, video uploads go and look at me going like oh man the the evac fire has completely fucked up my sense of rhythm to make videos like there's actual people who um you know had to actually evac from the fires at some point like i don't know i'll talk about it more later but for right now i'm just kind of tired man like i'm kinda, i'm that kind of tired that you don't want to do anything but also i literally just got to a thousand so if i stop it's like a shark if i stop moving that I know for a fact. I don't want to be like old Wokey for people who have been with me since the beginning. People remember that I used to go on extremely long hiatuses and it's mostly because like not because I was burnt out. Burnt out isn't the right word. It's just that I got tired and when I'm tired and specifically with the, the setup I have currently which is not a good setup for recording. Like that's the thing that um, really sucks is that my recording uh, lookout is terrible. Like, there's no good way for me to quickly record videos, and I can only record videos, um, late the fuck at night. And at any point, anyone could be wanting to use the bathroom, and then the entire video is ruined. And it's like, I don't know, man. It's tough. It's a tough situation, but you gotta keep on moving forward. Because that's really all you can do. Because like I said previously with sharks, if sharks stop moving, you die. So, we're here for grind and talk. And speaking of dying, it's the androids. Oh, poor trunks. I actually really like their special attack. It's, um... I want to say it's the move that killed uh, Future Gohan. I want to say that's their... Uh, at, it looks like it. Or, or at least didn't kill him. No, it killed him. Let me see. It's... See, they do a back up. And then it's like, Hakai. And then, boom. Damn. I can't believe they gave such a nice looking special attack to a free unit. It's actually kind of funny. I think, yeah, it's, their, their animations are better than the current ones we have, which have been in the game for an extremely long time. Oh, I need to get this game. What is LA Fan? LA Fan, what are you talking about? Are you talking about Revenge of King Piccolo, the previous game that I played? Everyone should check out that video, it's really good. Um, should I, should I live talk about the thing he just mentioned? Let me check what video he's talking about. He is talking about Revenge of King Piccolo. It's a Wii game. You can buy it on the Wii or you can find it on emulation. Thank you for the comment, though. Man, wouldn't it be awesome if you guys could see live grind and talks would be fun, but also they'd be over in less than 10 minutes. <sighs> Man, other than that, how, you know... You know, a lot of grinded talk is a lot of me talking, but I also just want to talk to you guys for a bit. So you know what? It's Sunday when this is releasing, so I just want to know, uh, how you been? How you doing, man? Tell me how your weekend's been going. Mine's been crazy, but that doesn't matter right now. How's yours been going? Um, I've been doing a lot of, uh, food, and I think that's all I need right now. Let me check. Uh, tell me how you been, though. Seriously, though. I'm interested. People, like... Um, all the people who watch my videos, which we don't have, uh, we don't have a name for you, so I'm just gonna call you very, my good, my very good buddies. Um, no, I'm not gonna call you that. You are my buddies, though. Point is, I don't want to start calling everyone buddy, and then it's gonna feel weird. But the thing I was saying is that the people who usually watch my videos leave a like, leave a comment, and are subscribed to me, for the most part, um. They don't leave a comments. Some leave comments, and I appreciate the ones that do. But for the most part, most people just kind of like, like the video, watch, and then move on. Um, but the people who do comment, I always try and talk to them. 
like um i'm very lucky that at where i am at now in youtube that's actually something that's very easy to do for me because it's like hey come on man let's talk i want to talk to you so if you want to tell me how your weekend's doing i'll answer back we can use that as grind and talk to like um you know just kind of talk to each other figure it out i was gonna say make it kind of like that um Oh, I forgot this. When I fought you, I did not have future Gohan, transforming future Gohan in this team. Um, I should be fine, whatever. Who cares? Oh no, this extremely good unit is not going to be. <laughs> Suddenly I'm losing. No. I'm not even using the right leader. I don't even know what the fuck you do, LR Trunks. You just stand there and look pretty. Unlike Goku Black, who stands there and doesn't use a special attack because the the friend unit I use does not have his ability on or some shit like that. Um, yeah, what was I talking about? Um, I've been thinking about uh, so it's been kind of slow video wise right now, but trust me, I have something very big planned uh that i think will hopefully be really cool as you all know i'm a big fan of halloween so there's some halloween stuff i've got prepared later on in the future that i hope you'll enjoy um man just to show you how much i did not play don't know there's just like nothing isn't it a bummer when you use anyway i got a lot of halloween stuff to prepare for that's all i'm willing to say right now uh so all of you who are listening to grind and talk right now get a special sneak preview of understanding i'm going to do eventually something and also, I completely picked the wrong goddamn category. There we go. Uh, let me see. Other than that, what else did I do this week? I saw Joker. God, it has been a long-ass week. I saw Joker at some point. Um, it was a good movie. I don't want to say too much just because it will spoil it, but... Uh, very good. I enjoy it. Um, not to say it's not flawless, because I definitely see a lot of flaws in it. And by a lot of flaws, I mean... I think it's kind of boring in the beginning, but I also think it's a, it's kind of a fucked if you do, fucked if you don't, because I also feel like if the beginning wasn't as slow as it was, then it wouldn't, like, then the rest of the movie wouldn't have the same impact, if that makes sense. So, it's kind of like one of those, I'm, I, when it comes to movies, I've always been someone who, if it's bad, I always still find something, the only movies that I truly don't like are movies that are just kind of bleh. Um, a good example of this is Hangover 2 is just kind of bleh. Hangover 3 is kind of bleh. So the idea of them making a Joker 2, I'm like, he's just going to make Joker 1 again. Like, the dude, the dude can't, um, the dude can't make a sequel to save his fucking life. Because Hangover 1, fantastic, funny, different for the time. Hangover 2, bad. J it's literally just Hangover 1, but not good. And then Hangover 3 is just awful. It's, it's like just it's just not that funny. So I'm kind of happy that he's stopped doing comedies because he's not funny. And you know, um, what's his nuts, uh, Zach Galifianakis, and you know a lot of the actual like um, comedians in those movies were holding those movies together. But the second like. Um, anything else disappears it's like whatever it's not that good do you remember when um zach galifianakis got um mel gibson kicked off the set of hangover 2 like hang uh mel gibson was supposed to have a cameo in hell uh in hangover 2 but then zach galifianakis you know for his own reasons i understand not wanting to work with him he said i'm in a big this is one of the very few times I have the ability to say no to someone. So I'm not going to work if your guys are going to use Mel Gibson. So I don't want him on here. So get him out of here. And uh, they listened. And to his credit, Mel Gibson said, hey, okay, I'm not going to be on here. And Mel Gibson had maybe one of the best responses as like, <laughs> which really just kind of shows the unfortunateness of everything because it's like um hey i get like not wanting to work with me that's fine but also you guys had mike tyson on and mike tyson went to jail for rape so i didn't i didn't hurt anyone i didn't kill anyone i made mistakes 
but come on, you have Mike Tyson on here. And it's like, he's kind of got your number there, Zach Galifianakis. Where the, oh, the difference is that you're a stand up to Mel Gibson because he's not going to say anything to you. Mel Gibson understands that he's in the doghouse. No one's going to talk shit to Mike Tyson because deep down, everyone knows that Mike Tyson could still knock you the fuck out if he wanted to. So, also, I guess, technically speaking, not technically speaking, actually speaking, Mike Tyson has gone to jail for his crimes. So, I guess it's kind of up to the individual at that point. That's what jail's supposed to be, right? It's supposed to be, like, rehabilitation for a person. It's supposed to be, like, um... Which is, I guess, the... Here's me discovering the flaws in the prison system. But not to get too, um... Political is not the right word. I'm not getting political. I'm just trying to show my thoughts. Um, but the idea of prison has always been the rehabilitation of a person, right? So once you're done and you've played for your crimes, then you're supposed to be good to go into modern society. But the problem is, is that people don't see prison as, uh, as you going to prison as, oh, you paid for your crimes. They see it as you're a criminal. So there is no rehabilitation because no matter what, people will always see you as what you are for what you were at that moment. So it doesn't matter how much good you try and do um, post-prison life is that people will always believe you to be the, um, the man you're not anymore. So, uh, so I understand like, I'm, I'm just going to look at this. I'm just... I'm almost positive I just fucked up and used another android. Is this correct? Who the fuck are you? I need to figure out what's up with that. Oh, I know what it is. Um, so yeah, there you go. There's my thoughts on the prison system. It's an extremely, like, I don't like talking out of turn about stuff I don't understand. Um, what I can understand about prison system is only things that I can think of through my own experience. Like, I don't work in the prison system. I don't work with those people i don't i don't i'm not in the dirt is what i'm trying to say so um kind of take my face i'm just trying to talk man i'm just trying to grind and talk i'm just trying to i know why i fucked up here he is um he's right here let me quickly search him out so yeah crazy and for the most part uh like i said i can understand someone kind of going like i can't forgive mel gibson because it doesn't feel like he's really forgiven for anything, but at a certain point, like, I don't know. I'm, I'm this kind of person I can understand. I've also been on the opposite side where I'm like, I don't want to let go of a grudge or anything. Like, I'm not trying to make it seem like I'm above grudges because I can hold a grudge for a real long ass time. The difference is, is that I don't do it to people anymore. I used to do it to people all the time just because, like, I don't know. I was a shitty kid and you know, shitty kids hold shitty grudges and stuff like that uh i guess also now that i'm talking about this i think it's finally time to say now that i somehow went into the fucking prison system i think that's it for grind and talk uh i still have some more stuff to grind but i can grind that off screen i also have to, i just also realized i need to edit this up and actually put it up there so whatever thank you for joining me tell me how your weekend is tell me if you have any like I guess I was going to say, if you have any thoughts about the prison system, then tell me about it. Uh, keep it respectful, as always. Um, try to have some form of respect. It's an extremely hard topic to talk about, so... Uh, so, yeah. Anyway, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. And for whatever video I decide to record next, who knows what it's going to be. Goodbye.